today is a day. Today is the day that I have decided I am officially going to switch from Premiere Pro to DaVinci Resolve for now. But first, if you're new around here, my name is Billy and I make videos about making videos. So hit the subscribe button if you're new and also the bell notifications back to the video. Why have I decided to switch from this awesome high-end editing software that's used for movies to this other program that very few people are actually talking about. Why have I decided to do this? It's because I can't rely on Premiere Pro. Premiere Pro pisses me off. It's a love-hate relationship. Like, I love it because it is an awesome tool, but I also hate it because it's not reliable. It crashes a lot, it freezes a lot, it has a bunch of random glitches, and Adobe seems to just be putting out newer versions and newer versions that have the same, if not worse, problems. Things on Premiere Pro run slow. And if Premiere's not crashing, it's freezing. And if it's not freezing, it's having a dynamic linking issue. And if it's not having a dynamic linking issue, it's having a rendering issue. And if it's not having a rendering issue, then Jesus has come back. All of that to say is Premiere Pro always has an issue. Now I've been hearing a lot about DaVinci Resolve for a while. This is not just a today I decided to switch. This is something that I've been actually researching for the last six months because I've been thinking about this. When they dropped version 16 of DaVinci Resolve, when I decided that this actually seems like it's better than Premiere Pro. Has integrated VFX, it has integrated sound, like all of the sound panels, everything, it's in there. It has high quality playback and rendering. It's fast, it's free, free. So with all of that being said, I decided that I have nothing to lose. I had to ask myself a question. What's the reason why I'm not switching to DaVinci Resolve? Is it because I have a loyalty to Adobe? Yes, I love Adobe. I love their programs. I learned on their program. Well, I actually learned on Sony Vegas, but I really learned on their programs a lot. And it actually requires me to learn another program. So that's the downside. But on the other hand, I could have a reliable, stable program that has great customer support, amazing playback, awesome rendering times, and VFX and audio and, and all these things. Now I understand that Adobe has its advantages. In my mind right now, all I'm trying to do is find a stable solution for editing that is high quality, it's effective, it's not gonna crash every five minutes. I'm gonna bring you guys for this journey. I'm gonna be showing you how to do some things, tutorials, all of these things, because this is a very new program. It's super cool, it's exciting. I'm a little nervous, honestly, because I don't know the program, but it seems like it's gonna be a really good thing when I learn it. So for now, I am using DaVinci Resolve. I want efficiency and stability. And if Premiere Pro can offer that one day, I'm down for it. Let me know in the comments below if you would actually switch to DaVinci Resolve. And if you have, what do you think of it? So with all that being said, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a like, share, and subscribe to the channel to join the community of filmmakers and storytellers. Until the next one, peace.